Hey, my guy, I just want to show you how I drink my teas because I know that you were told to drink teas. I actually keep these jars here. I save my jars and I reuse them. Okay. And so I just refilled these two. This is uh, turmeric. And this over here is just ginger. Usually I mix both of them. But anyway, believe it or not, I make onion tea. I use the peel of the onion and I put cloves in it. And I even use my orange peel. But you do have to wash the, the orange. I feel it's got some very good benefits, but I can't tell you which ones they are. I need to look it up and refresh my mind. Uh, but here I have other teas, right? You could buy teas at stores. And uh, this one over here is a bitter tea. That's great for if you have ice cream, a treat, and then you want to bring down the sugar. Same thing. There's another bitter tea over here. And this over here is, um, this is actually for the liver. I had fatty liver. I just got a good report from my doctor. Uh, and over here, I have valerian root because sometimes I do get hypertension from the pain that I've been getting. It has created high blood pressure, which I never had, and hypertension. So I put a little bit of valerian root in there, and there's a piece of ginger that I had extra, so I just threw it in there. Uh, but these are my teas. And uh, since the room temperature in, at home is still like under 60, uh, it's starting to hit uh, 60 now. Like it's like 61 now. So now I have to start refrigerating them. So thus, it, there's a good, good, good reason why I enjoy. I like the winter because uh, things don't need to be so refrigerated. Uh, everything's got to be stuck in the fridge when it's um, the house is warming up. Uh, but this is how I do it, and it has worked. I think that these teas are what really healed me of my Walking Dead cholesterol. When I say walking dead, it was like, I don't think doctors have seen it as high for a few years, quite frankly. So God spared me. And um, I really believe these teas had a lot to do with it. Although I was taking also a bunch of um, uh, herbal remedies. I take a lot of vitamins. And let me just show you how that looks. Give me one second. Okay, and so these are my vitamins for the daytime. Two of them are calcium, the rocky ones, kind of squarish. Whatever, you know, these over here. Let's see where my finger is. Okay, can you see my finger or my hand? Where's my camera? Okay, so this one, white one over here and that white one over there. Th those are calcium. I just got a bone density test and I definitely do. I just started taking the calcium, but it shows that I need it. So right on time. I, I mean, I always knew it, but uh, sometimes, you know, I slack off, right? And you see the two red ones. Let's see where my finger is. The camera would show where, where the camera is. Okay, so this is where it is. Okay, so you see this one over here and this one over here. These are for the cholesterol. Um, I my cholesterol is walking dead, and now it's not high enough to be prescribed. Uh, so I'm almost a hundred percent there. And then um, sometimes I get mental fog, so I use that round little one, and I think this white one and that white one. Um, and then, um, let me see what's my finger. So two of these are for eyes, uh, for eye vision. And then two of them are cod liver oil, uh, those dark jelly ones. So I hope this is helpful. You could actually prepare a batch of teas and put them in your fridge. Um, or actually if you have a cooler, put some ice in it and keep it there. Whatever it takes, uh, to help you get disciplined in doing what you have to do. I hope this is helpful for you. Thank you and bye.